Hi all, welcome to my YouTube channel, The Testing Instinct. In this video, I will be discussing about using custom JavaScript function directly in request body or payload with Bruno. In real time, during API testing, we might need to pass some dynamic data. To do this, we might be writing some custom JavaScript function and we need to use the return value of that function in the payload directly. In Bruno, to achieve this, we have to follow this particular approach. The approach is to write a custom JavaScript function based on your requirement in the script tab under prerequisites section in Bruno. After that, you can set the variable using bru.setWare method like this. And after that, you can directly use that variable in the desired payload of the request. So I will be showing this during the demo. I have already opened Bruno. I am using the collection called request. Here I have created one post request. The name of the request is use JS function in request body. So this is the API endpoint. We are using the request endpoint. In the script section we have to write this function we are writing this function in the prerequisite section so that this will be executed before the request execution i am saving the request so this particular javascript function will be generating the current date here i am only showing an example based on your requirement you can create any methods here this method will be only generating a current date now the current date value has to be stored in a variable to implement that we have to use this particular line just add that line under this method so this particular line will be setting a variable called date value inside that the return value of this get current date will be stored i am saving the request again now in the body tab just use this payload i am selecting it as json i am storing the payload this is how you can pass a javascript function in body or payload of a request i am saving the request you can see i have reused the variable which i have set in the script tab so this was the variable inside this variable we have stored the return value of this, this corresponding custom javascript function after that we are directly using that variable inside the request body or payload so this is just an example for generating current date based on your requirement you can use any javascript function now i am going to execute this particular request you can see the current date and you can see the green color as well this is how you can use a custom javascript function directly in bruno i hope this session was useful to everyone if you find this session helpful, please consider subscribing the channel. Please like, share and if you have any queries, please comment on the video. I will be clearing out the queries. Thanks for watching and keep learning.